Hi, I'm Miss Gordon. In this video, I'm going to read you the story, Potato, a tale from the Great Depression, written by Kate Lead and illustrated by Lisa Campbell Ernst. The Great Depression was a time back in the 1930s when the economy crashed, and that means that many families lost their jobs and were very poor and struggled to survive. This is a story about my grandfather and my grandmother. It is also a story about the Great Depression and how hard things were. Once upon a time, there was a mother named Agnes and a father named Clarence. They had a baby girl named Dorothy. Dorothy and her parents lived in Iowa. Clarence and Agnes had not been married long. Clarence lost his job and the bank took away their house. Agnes's father had a job in the coal mine and Clarence joined him. Then, one day, the coal mine closed. There were no other jobs available. People took jobs wherever they could find them. Someone they met told them that there were jobs in Idaho picking potatoes. Agnes knew someone who had a car they could borrow. So they borrowed money for gas and left Iowa with Dorothy. For two weeks, they lived in tents. During the day, they picked potatoes. Dorothy played in the fields among the potato plants. The man who owned the farm said that they, in their own time, at night, could go out into the picked over fields and get the leftover potatoes. So they bought used burlap sacks for a penny each. They went out at night and picked potatoes and put them in the sacks. At the end of the two weeks, they loaded up Dorothy and the potatoes and headed home. There were potatoes wherever there was room for potatoes, on the dashboard, hood, trunk, and running boards. Dorothy had to sit on the potato sacks. The money they had earned from working, they used for gas. When they got back home, Clarence and Agnes traded potatoes for other things. Groceries, clothes, and even a pig. They worked very hard to live on what little they had. At last, Clarence found a job and the family moved to Washington, D.C. and then to Hawaii. Soon, Dorothy had two baby brothers, Bob and Gary. Late at night, Dorothy told the boys stories of potatoes and how they were picked by the light of the moon. All this could be how I have become to like potatoes. The end.